Tonight. You guys lived in Chennai? Yeah. 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 Chennai and she was going to Chennai Equitation Center here. We are here in Chennai uh, for, a, for a surgery on a horse. Uh, this is, uh, uh, his name is Iliesta and uh, he's a very special horse uh, of a very special owner mm -hmm. and she's basically going to, you know, tell the story of Iliesta but um, yeah, so. Hi, so um, we got Iliesta probably around, um, we bought him around two and a half months ago and he's from the Netherlands and he's now stabled at the Red Earth Riding School and um, he's a very sweet horse and unfortunately he hurt his eye uh, the first time in the quarantine center that's when we first contacted Dr. Kasturi um, but while that was healing we started to notice that um, there was a brown uh, iris cyst on his other eye which was free floating if it's a free floating cyst uh, it can actually move in the anterior chamber of the eye okay and it can actually grow in size Okay, slowly and steadily it can grow in size and because it, it constantly floats within the eye suddenly sometimes the you know when the horse is running the cyst can suddenly come in the way and they can, can cause yes. that spooking what we are going to do today is basically sedate him and you know uh, pop that cyst uh, with the with the laser and because with the laser you don't have i mean it doesn't really harm the external structures okay. of the eye. There's no wound on the eye. It basically goes in and pops the cyst. Pops it. So that's the best part. Oh wow! And he's yeah, so that he will be able to compete in uh, the, the international, FBI, yeah. the FBI. FBI, and the nationals are just coming up yeah. right now. Yeah, beautiful spot. This is it. Take him out. Well, just examine him here. Yeah. It's a big one. Yeah. All these horses are competition horses. Uh, apart from a few which are just leisure horses, they're all competing either in the nationals or in the Premier Leagues or in the internationals. In fact, many of them are gone for the internationals right now. Uh, this is uh, right next to the beach, so the horses go out for hacks on the beach, yeah. and it's it's a really it's a nice life. place. Yeah. So before I give him sedation, I have to be ready with the laser because as soon as he's sedated, I don't want to waste any time and uh, just quickly sedate him. Given him auricular palpebral and supra orbital block. This is just going to make his uh, eyelid easy to manipulate. It's pop. Spot? Oh. It was a nice oh. big round uh, blob. It's not going to, like we are not going to evaporate it completely. Okay. What I just did, uh, uh, there's a big hole underneath. Okay. So I popped it. And okay. it's... What will happen to this black thing? It will, it will shrink. So it was a fluid filled ball. Okay. So we've made a hole and let the fluid out. Out. Okay. okay. I'm just going to give him some uh, painkiller. Pakoda. Bye. This is uh, this is Plunex in. It's okay, it's okay. Good heart. So the surgery is done. Uh, it was literally five minute surgery because of the uh, because of the laser. He was sedated well enough, but he was moving a little bit, and uh, there was not not enough darkness. 
and uh, not enough light in one uh, you know location so we kind of did a lot of jugad and you know got an umbrella to get the light uh, to get make it dark and uh, it worked quite beautifully